It's been more than a year since the ill-fated expedition to the wreckage of the Titanic resulted in five deaths. This week, a Coast Guard investigation of what happened got underway. During four days of testimony, new details have been revealed about what happened to the Ocean Gate Titan submersible vehicle. Michael George is here with the latest on the investigation. Michael, good morning. Jeff, good morning. We're finally learning more about just what happened in the minutes leading up to that catastrophic implosion that took the lives of five people. And now some experts are raising questions about whether warning signs were ignored. Could the Titan submersible tragedy have been prevented? In a Coast Guard hearing Friday, a passenger who previously rode the Titan was asked if he ever felt unsafe in the craft. It was not safe diving in the Titan, and it, it was never supposed to be safe. And if it was safe, then uh, yeah, my, you might as well just get in a trolley car and ride around town. The Titan was on a tourism expedition to view the wreckage of the Titanic in June of 2023, when it imploded underwater. All five on board were killed, including Ocean Gate's co-founder Stockton Rush. Mission specialist Renata Rojas tearfully recounted her final conversation with the crew. They were just very happy to go. And that's the memory I have. Nobody was really nervous. Um, they were a little excited about what they're going to see. One of the crew's final communications was the message, all good here. 30 minutes later, they lost contact. This video shows the submersible's tail cone, roughly 1,600 feet from the Titanic. Some experts testified they previously raised red flags about the craft and were ignored. Well, there seem to be a lot of problems with this system. Former engineering contractor Antonella Wilby says when a passenger reported hearing a loud bang, like an explosion, she notified Ocean Gate officials. And her response to that was that, yes, many people are concerned about you. Um, you don't seem to have an explorer mindset. And I was kind of taken aback by that. The goal of the hearings is to find out how this trip went so terribly wrong and to try and prevent similar tragedies from happening again. Nothing is going to bring our friends back. I hope that this investigation creates an understanding that with exploration, there's risk. The Coast Guard hearing will continue next week. Ocean Gate has suspended its operations since the fatal accident. Nancy? Michael, thank you.